President of Belarus Alexander Lukashenko has signed a decree confirming the country's official support for the free circulation of cryptocurrencies such as Bitcoin. The initiative reaffirms the commitment to support the development of cryptocurrencies, including crypto mining and trading. As previously reported in September 2021, Lukashenko called on the government to use alternate power to mine cryptocurrencies. Earlier, Belarus' largest financial institution, Banco Belarus, launched a cryptocurrency exchange service. On February the 15th, the head of Amplify ETF is bullish on Bitcoin as a hedge against the inflation. Despite the recent market downturn and plans to add exposure to digital assets to the firm's latest trading platform related to exchange traded fund, the investment house had already launched its new fund, Inflation Fighter ETF, earlier this month, which aims to identify stocks and commodities that can withstand inflation, such as agriculture, energy, precious metals, and Bitcoin. MasterCard said it will expand its consulting business to work on cryptocurrency, open banking, and ESG. As a veteran international credit card organization with 20,000 members and more than 21 million merchants and ATMs, MasterCard's global presence and wide range of terminal merchants will significantly enhance the user's access to cryptocurrencies.